we have one big enemy. We just have to come together to confront that, to confront those who control corporate power and they're destroying us all. So we just have to come together. Forget the little differences. They don't matter. It's very dangerous and I think they, the people in charge of the, the big organizations, the World Bank, the European Union, the IMF, they're on a runaway machine that cannot stop and it's charging downhill because their system of big private companies competing with each other, big private corporations, they have to, they have to pursue their agenda or they die. They have to, they have to find a workforce that is cheap, that is vulnerable, so they have to attack the labour regulations, which Hollande is doing now, to, to suit them. They can't protect the environment, they've got to get cheap fuel, they've got to produce and produce and produce, because their profit margins are getting smaller. So to keep their profit margins getting smaller because they're in a big competition. So they have to win the contract. So they so they cut their costs, so they cut their profit. So the only way they can get more profit is by producing more, getting more. And to survive they have to do that. And the only way they can do that is to destroy the planet in the end. So they're on they're on a a roller coaster that can't stop. And we are the only people who can stop them, whether we're in the streets, whether we're in political groups, wherever we are. The little film we've made here is about the, the conscious cruelty of the bureaucracy, where if you are poor, you are told, well, it's your fault you're poor, it's your own fault. If you're unemployed, it's your fault you haven't got a job. You know, it's not the fault of the, the system that produces unemployment, it's your fault, because you're not working hard enough. No change will have a big effect until we really tackle the power of the big corporations and reorganize the world on a, on a properly democratic basis where we, we, we produce for need and not for profit. It's the idea that we are only consumers, that the competition is the only way we can live and the competition has to be based on private ownership of property, private profits. Um, the whole neoliberal program. Until we challenge that, it's no use simply putting in another regulation or trying to put a, a protection for the for this species or protection for that piece of land or that ocean or workers' rights in isolation. Because until we tackle the the motor that is driving this chaos, which is the 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 neoliberal agenda, the, the big corporations keeping power and wrecking, wrecking people's lives, wrecking the environment, um, demanding wars of intervention, which have had terrible consequences in what we call the Middle East, and all driven by the needs of big corporations for market share, for cheap labour, for cheap raw materials to impose their will on the European Union, on the United States, on wherever. Until we confront that, we, we, we can't win.